it's a weird creation process to see this thing and to have a vision. And sometimes the glass takes you on a different route. The gallery at Flame Run is filled with colorful and unique glass pieces. The new glassmakers exhibit showcases local artists' work, but features pieces from Ben Edels and Kathy Elliott, a couple from Australia. They make some very classical, beautiful shapes, and then they do this really intricate carving on it. These pieces, big or small, all start the same way, as liquid in a 2,000-degree furnace. Brooke White, the owner of Flame Run, starts by dipping a blowpipe to gather what he calls hot honey. You put some color on it. There's many different ways to put patterns and, and coloring techniques together, and then you start to blow. White's breath goes into the glass and creates a bubble. He says to create pieces like the one in the exhibit, even body movement can impact the final product. Ben's work and Kathy's work is very symmetrical. It's got these beautiful lines, beautiful forms. The detail on some of their pieces resemble waves. That carving work is done after the glass is cooled. Before, it's still really hot. It's still probably around 1,000 degrees at that point. We have to put it into what we call a cooling down oven, and it goes in there and usually stays at least overnight. After 20 years of glass blowing, White is still mesmerized by the process. He says that's what makes the final product so rewarding. Sometimes you have to be able to go with what the glass is telling you to do, but it's just sort of magical that you can take the substance and turn it into something beautiful. Alex Durham, WLKY News.